Hey YouTube, this is Cutie Pie 88. Um, I'm coming to you with a wig review today. Um, please excuse my braids. Um, they are a hot mess. This is just for, you know, under my wigs. Um, so please excuse this. Um, I'm doing a wig review today on a wig. Um, oh God, I don't even want to put my hands down. Um, a wig that I have um, from Elevate Styles. It is called um, Americano. It's an Americano wig. It's a part of the new Deep Invisible Part line by Model Model or Model Model, however you want to say it. Um, it's their new line of lace part wigs. It has the wig has a a deep lace part. They call it deep because. It goes all the way back. It looks really natural um, when you put it on. Um, so it's a part of their new line. And I got it in a color 99J, which is the deep burgundy. And as you can see, the wig has little crinkles in it. Um, you can flat iron those out. I flat ironed them a little bit. That's why they're kind of subtle now. Um, it, it just gives it a, a cute, you know, kind of edge to it. Um, like I said, it's a deep invisible part. It has a little lace right here. Um, I attempted to put a little makeup on the lace to make it more my skin tone, um, the scalp more my skin tone, but it messed up. It kind of clumped up in the part, so it didn't look right. Um, but this is the Americana wig, and I'm going to put it on so you, you guys can see how it looks. Also, this wig has no combs. Okay, you guys, I am back with the wig on. As you can see, um, it's very simple. It's very easy to make it look like you have a quick weave. My daughter is like trying to bust in on me in the bathroom, so please excuse her. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> anyway, um, as you can see, like this wig is perfect for if you want to just put something on and go like the only thing um okay here's here's a little here's some cons to this wig it tends to have the little egg shape thing going on up here um it's kind of pointy um let's see I've been told that this wig really looks natural. The part looks real. When I tell people oh, it's a wig, they just don't believe me. Um, my daughter is like going crazy right now. Hey. Hey, you what? What? She can't stand me being closed in here without her seeing what's going on. Um, so like I said, this wig if you want like a simple bob wig that just looks like a quick weave, this is the one to get. Now what I did was, as you can see, my braids are really fuzzy. I parted my hair and when my where my hair is naturally parted, I lay the lace part. So um, I don't know, that's just something I do. I feel more comfortable doing that rather than putting it on top of a braid. Um, so yeah, I, I did um, razor this bang just a little bit. I raised it with my razor comb, but guys, I did very minimal razor cutting. Um, let me turn around so you can see the back. I did cut this a little bit straight across because it was a little long. And here's the lace part again. And it's really, really cute, you guys. 
Um, I did curl this bang. This wig can be curled up to 400 degrees, I believe. Um, and it did come with this side already razored and this side already razored. So you don't even have to worry about cutting any bangs. Um, I did curl it with my flat iron on a low setting about 200 degrees and I when I curled it I held it there a little long and it it kept its shape you guys I've been wearing this wig for about three or four days now I went to the beach on Memorial Day yesterday and I got in the beach water with this wig on like the waves were hitting me my wig was sliding back I was like it's crazy oh by the way this wig does not have any combs so you're going to need to pin it down with bobby pins. But the waves was hitting me. You know, my hair, I intended not for my hair to get wet. But it got soaked. And when I tell you it dried very quickly under the sun. I, I dried it with a towel. It dried and it popped right back to this style that you're seeing now. I have not washed this wig after the salt water from the beach. I was like, why do I need to wash it? Because it's still flowy. Look at that that's after beach water it's still flowy it still has its curl like it's crazy and it's just perfect the only another um one more downfall besides this cone shape at the top is that it's thin um to my liking it's thin um some some people may like it like this but um it's on the thin side as you can see you can kind of see that here's the side and then there's the back right here so what i did was i picked up some 99j hair from my local beauty supply store um in eight inches some 99j hair as you can see it's burgundy it matches the well it matches pretty well um once i blend it in in the back it's going to look better but mostly i'm going to put it right here on the sides because the back is pretty much tapered very nicely um so i don't want to mess that up putting long hair in the back but I'll, i'm going to put some on the side to thicken up this this area down here just to thicken it up a little bit but overall you guys pick this wig up this wig is $24.99 on www.elevatestyles with an s.com. So I'll put the link below and all the information you need to know. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Like I said, I'm going to add some more hair to this wig um, just because it's a little thin to my liking. Um, but as far as everything else, I've been getting tons of compliments. Ladies, go pick this bob wig up. If you're not a you know hairstylist but you want that summer bob, guys, pick it up. Ladies, gents, whoever, pick this wig up. You will not be sorry. It's super cute and it has tons of colors to choose from. From ombre to red to regular colors 1B. You guys just check it out. Alright, hope you enjoyed this tutorial and I'll be back with you later. Bye.